What is this thing? Okay. I want each of you to cook a donut for me. It'll be done. This will be the darkest donut. What won't you do for your beloved granddaughter? I think that cooking donuts in a special device is very convenient and fast. You just need to pour the dough. Oh yeah, I can do that. Only my donuts will be colored because it's so much more fun. Cool. Granddaughter, you're such a dreamer. <sighs> yeah, there's too much snot. See what a real donut should be like. They're black, but they're probably delicious. <laughs> the black color is the best combined with red. So I'll pour red glaze on my donuts. And I'll add a little white on top. Right now. Let's do this. So they will become even more beautiful. Hint, help me. Bring me a deep plate right now. I'll pour strawberry syrup in it. What? Perfect. Then I'll put in sand juice. What for? Now you'll see for yourself. Hey. Granny, do you want a trick? Look. This is blood. Who oh, was scaring a lady like that? Come on, it's just syrup. I'm trying for your granddaughter's sake. I want her to taste not only delicious, but also beautiful donuts. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. What? If they had brought that to me, I would have fainted for sure. Now I'll show you how normal donuts should look like. Firstly, there's absolutely no need to make them black. And for beauty, a little powdered sugar will be enough. Just look at how beautiful it is. Awesome! <laughs> oh. Beauty is my donuts. One look at them is enough to cheer yourself up. But to make them even more fun, why not add a little bright sprinkle? However, first I need to open this damn jar. Now come on! Oh. Yeah, Rebecca, you did open the jar. Now look how much more cheerful you are. The main thing is that it got on the donuts. Margot, it's time to pick a winner. Oh, Wednesday made donuts in her own style. They look pretty creepy, but in fact, they are very tasty. Mm, and Sergius with syrup, it's a great idea. Awesome. Grandma, now I'm going to try your donuts. I won't lie, they're so so. Too simple. Oh, but Rebecca's donuts look much more interesting. I hope they taste good too. <sighs> These are the most delicious donuts that I've ever tried! You're the winner! Oh, I love you too, Margot! Hmm. Oh, Wednesday, stop scaring an old lady! In this round, you have to make a cocktail for me. Delicious and beautiful. Okay. It will be done. <laughs> no problem. Good. Oh. A win-win option is to make a cocktail from what Margot loves most. For example, you can start with toxic waste candies. But I don't need the lollipops themselves. I need to make these candies turn into a liquid mass. In general, I need to melt them. Perfect. Now it's time to add candy Skittles. Wow! Let's do this. <laughs> there can be no doubt about it. Everyone loves these sweets. But first, they need to be divided by color so that after they are beautifully distributed among our colored and delicious cups. And now it's time for the Sprite. Let's pour it in. It'll be the basis of the cocktail, only now it is almost impossible to open it. I'll use a hairpin for this. Oh! How so? Wet and sweet. Poor Rebecca. I'm alright. I just took a Sprite shower, but that's not all. What kind of cocktail without whipped cream? And a little candy won't hurt. Ta-da! My masterpiece is ready. Oh, you're so great. But your cocktails are not healthy at all. And Margot needs vitamins, so the cocktail should be as useful as possible. Vitamins are mostly in vegetables, so why not just make a vegetable cocktail? Perfect. It smells great. I'm sure Margot will be absolutely delighted. I doubt that. I'll start making my cocktail with strawberry syrup. 
I'll pour it into a glass so that it immediately becomes much more beautiful. Then the spray will go into action, which I will touch up a little with the help of green syrup. Hand. I need your help again. Still some whipped cream for me. <laughs> Someday I'll crush this thing. It's so creepy. Hey. And it stole my cream. Thank you. You did everything right. And they're just joking. Finally, I'll add cream to the cocktail and, of course, why not decorate it with a marmalade eye? In my opinion, it turned out cool. Margot, decide which cocktail is the winner. Wednesdays always has the most original one. Okay. Let's see. Mm. You've got a very delicious cocktail. Marmalade is just the cherry on the cake, more precisely, an eye. Oh. Uh. Grandma, have you made a mixture of all the vegetables again? You know I can't stand this stuff. Ugh, disgusting! And my sister came up with something cool again! Let's try how it tastes! Amazing! Rebecca, you have one again! Hooray! Don't worry, someday you'll be lucky! <laughs> Surprise me with delicious pasta this time! Okay! I have a couple of thoughts! Oh, oh, pasta? Oh, oh, okay, easily. There's nothing easier than cooking spaghetti for my granddaughter. Do you know how I'll know that the water in the pot is hot? A hand will help me. Never repeat it at home because the thing does not feel the heat at all. Although, it's still unpleasant for it. Pre-made spaghetti is boring. Why don't I cook them myself? I have flour. <laughs> oh! Oh, now everyone has flour! Don't yell, Grandma! I didn't mean to! We need to knead the dough. And to do this, you need to add raw eggs. Um, oh. Then roll it all thoroughly. So, the foundation is ready. It's time to color the dough so that the spaghetti turns out bright. Next, you need to roll out the dough in a special machine. And then cut it into spaghetti knits. So my color pasta will be ready soon. Nice. Even store brought spaghetti can be cooked with what? love. However, oh. because of this steam, I can't see anything at all. Rebecca, did I overdo it with the ketchup? No, Grandma, you didn't even open it. Oh, what am I? Oh, what a horror! Oh, Wednesday. Oh Look, you usually oh, no. like this kind of spectacle. Oh, oh Rebecca. Thanks for the napkin. I'll finally be able to continue cooking pasta. Have very little left to add ketchup to the spaghetti. Delicious, but so boring. Do you know how to make spaghetti more interesting? We need to paint them black. Grandma gave me an interesting idea. Why not add horror to my portion with ketchup and an eye? I do like this idea. It's very scary. Another thing is my color pasta. Hope Margot will appreciate it. Nice. <laughs> Wednesday, will you stop scaring me already? The food is, again, very interesting, but this is not pasta. Grandma, but you make classic spaghetti with ketchup. It's pretty delicious. You're my girl. I wonder what Rebecca has come up with. I hope these spaghetti are not only beautiful, but also delicious. <laughs> Awesome! I tried specially for you. Rebecca, you won again! Hooray! I'm lucky! Hmm. Wednesday, I almost forgot. I brought a hairpin especially for you. I think it'll suit you very well. I don't wear such things. <laughs> oh. And this time, prepare Caesar salad for me. Okay. Easy. I can oh. cook salads. <laughs> I'll try. For Caesar, the main thing is not to spare cabbage. Some chicken. And of course, rat crackers, which are too contracted to me because they're too tough. And some grated cheese on top. I know Margot adores it. I'll make a spring gift for Margot. It won't be Caesar, but I think she'll like my edible flowers on long stems. <gasps> Wednesday, look! What a cool idea! Nothing cool. Here's my idea, and it's really cool. I'll make a salad right in the pepper. I'll paint all the ingredients there. Be sure to make a tongue out of cucumber, and I'll make eyes out of olives. Look what a cute frog I got. 
<laughs> Let's see what you have repaired this time. Rebecca, you've come up with something really cool! But it tastes like the most ordinary vegetables. Here, Granny knows how to cook delicious Caesar. And today's no exception. It's very tasty! Wednesday, are those olives? I can't stand them! Grandma, congratulations on your victory! Oh, finally! I've been waiting for so long! Looks like grandma and sister are having a great time. Well, enough distractions. It's time to find out what we'll cook. A burger? Wow! Well, are you all ready for a new challenge? Oh, Let's go. Okay. So, grandma starts with burger buns. Yes, toasted buns are much better. Now we need minced meat. Grandma takes minced meatballs. Puts them in a frying pan. Presses down with a spatula like this. The patty is ready. Now a slice of delicious cheese and of course, what kind of burger without tomato? There's an onion and a bun on top. Wow, grandma coped with the task so quickly. Great job, grandma. Now it's sister's turn. It looks like the ordinary buns won't do. What, a donut? How delicious. The sister cuts the donut into two halves. Now the chocolates. How sweet it is. But sister has something else. It's sour gel. It's so delicious, Whoa. but so sour. Now let's add marshmallows. A little marmalade. And berry syrup. Why not? Now we cover our miracle burger. What a beauty. It looks like grandma appreciated her granddaughter's work, but one's day is not so easy to surprise. So we start as usual with buns. Of course the black ones. Frying a patty like this. What is one's day doing with a piece of cheese? Wow, how cool this cheese looks now. A piece of cucumber? Okay. Wow, this burger seems to have a mouth with a tongue. But something is missing. It's good that next to Wednesday, there's always a hand that will help with any problem. Marmalade eyes! Hello! <laughs> Looks like that what Wednesday needs. Hey, careful, Grandma! The hand is completely harmless. Now let's add ice to the burger. Okay. Wow, just look at this monster. He's so scary, but still so appetizing. But which burger will be the most delicious? Now we'll find out. Margot, your turn. Oh, how hungry I am! This burger looks unusual. Let's try it! Delicious! I like it! So, what's next for us? Let's take the first bite. Ew! Is that onion? What a mess! The burger is not what you need. So, what do we have here? These are my favorite sweets! Snack on marmalade with a donut? It's to my taste. Well, it's time to choose the winner. And that is… This burger. Yes, this is our winner. Wow, congratulations to Wednesday. Um, is it just me or is she smiling? Wednesday smiling? Wow. Oops, that looks like someone was shy. It seems the sister and the hand have found a common language. Oh, it's time for the hand to go home. And it's time for our heroes to cook a new dish. Hot chocolate! Who doesn't love this delicious drink? I hope everyone is ready. Let's go. Grandma takes up cooking again. She pours milk into a saucepan. Now cacao powder. Do not forget to stir. Oh yes, a bar of chocolate will make the taste even more intense. Mm, how sweet it is! Grandma pours hot chocolate into her signature mug. Great job, Grandma. Now it's sister's turn. Hey, careful! You can eat all the chocolate like that. Yeah, Grandma is right. Sugar needs to be added quite a bit. Like that. Oh, what is she up to? Yeah, just look at this sweet tooth. Grandma does not approve of this amount of sugar. Okay, it's time to add milk. Be careful! Oops. Yeah, the sister clearly needs to be more attentive. So, you can add all the ingredients. Now a little dye. Wow, look at this beauty! This cream is so bright. 
Now a little sprinkles. That's the serving. Sister did her best. But that's not all. The final touch is whipped cream and… Some marshmallows. Look at the sweetness. Yeah, sister did her best. Perfect. Well, it's your turn, Wednesday. A suitable mug is neat here. The hand we can't do without your help here. What a horror! Grandma, you better take care of your nerves. Wednesday pours chocolate and some whipped cream. Berry syrup? Uh, great. And some Haribo marmalades. Oh yeah, look at this unique serving. Hot chocolate is ready. Hmm. Why? Oh! It's crazy! This is delicious! I like it! <gasps> oh, and moving on. This is hot chocolate from grandma. Great. Um, what is this? It looks strange, but let's try. Hmm, not bad. And the winner is… Yes! Sister, this round is for you! Well, it looks like our heroes are ready for a new challenge. What a waste them this time. Whoa, it's french fries! There are many ways to cook and serve this dish. Now we'll find out which way our heroes will choose. Of course, the potatoes need to be peeled first. What's going on? Wow, sister has chosen a very unusual way of peeling potatoes. Grandma isn't happy, but how can she be angry at her beloved granddaughter? <laughs> now you need to get the potatoes. <laughs> That's it. The sister cuts potatoes with a special knife. Look at this beauty! It's time to add some color. Wow, that is so bright! Add oil. And we can set our bright potatoes to the frying pan. Great! With hot oil, you should always be extremely careful. Hey! Be careful! We beautifully spread our colored potatoes on a plate. Sister got such bright french fries. Grandma prefers a more classic version of the dish. And sometimes the classic version is the best, isn't it? Oh yeah, french fries and ketchup. This taste is familiar to everyone since childhood. What could be better? Oops. Great job, Grandma. Hooray! Okay. Well, what will surprise us this time with Wednesday? The Wednesday potatoes are already cooked. It looks like an usual serving. But wait. What is this? No! Oh no. Looks like Wednesday got the sides mixed up. Grandma, you better cover your eyes. This is not a sight for the faint-hearted. So, where were we? Oh yeah, french fries. Wednesday paints potatoes black. Wow, how beautiful it is. It looks like sister appreciated Wednesday dish too. Look at her reaction. Well, let's see what Margot thinks. Well, what do we have here? Whoa, is this potato a little burnt? No, okay. doesn't taste bad. And with ketchup? Just super. Oh, I guess I won't hold back and eat everything to the last piece. Yummy. To the next one. Well, hmm, not bad. Let's see. But it'll taste even better this way. Well, goodbye, potatoes. I'm gonna eat you. Wow! Mm, I think I've had a little too much, but there's still a third course. What a beautiful dish! Yet it's very right, tasty. All right, all right. I can already feel it. Awesome. So good. To the last piece. Mm. Wow! Oops. Oh, 